All right, we're going to take a look at a rigging bowline real quick. It's going to be tied in the same basic manner that your Yosemite bowline is. Uh, just as we normally do, go from right to left, cross that object in this configuration where we're kind of going from the bottom to the top. You're going to get yourself extra rope. Uh, the end of this is going to be the tail uh, over the side of this, just as we did with the before. Palm faces away from us. Flip that around. Bring that up. Now, in a normal Yosemite bowline, we're taking the end through to create our bowline. In this case, we're actually going to put a bite through. So as we place that bite through there, it'll come up just like so. And then, just like we do on a regular bowline, we're going to kind of grab there. This is going to flip around and form our closed helix there, our nipping turn. Now, with this, you'll kind of see the configuration that you would normally see on your bowline here. So here's what's normally our tail. It's going to go just as the other one. It's going to follow this nipping turn around and come out the bite. So it's going to go back behind there, over and around. So when it does that, we're actually creating XP about two more nipping turns. And then this is going to follow that rotation and come right out that bite. So when we tighten this down, like we do before, we're going to go ahead and tighten down on the, on the line that's coming out that we're going to be utilizing. The next one we're tightening down is actually on this port, which cinches everything down. So when it's going, everything is tightening uh, around that system. And that is your rigging bowline. Uh, in the next video, we'll show you how to rig with it.